Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Technically third video, but if you noticed, I um, deleted that 20 minute video. I kind of went on ranting about a bunch of stuff that was completely unnecessary. So I do apologize for that. I'm, I'm working on it, okay? So I'm gonna try to keep them 10 minutes. This one might only be a five minute video, but hey, I mean, it's a short video. Keep you guys entertained for that good amount of time. Uh, I got a couple mods to talk about. If you are an older subscriber, you probably know what one of them is going to be since I deleted the last one. Then I got one new one for the old subscribers, and they're both new for new ones. And if you're a new subscriber, I suggest you just watch the my last video. I got a, I got a few mods in that one that I think are pretty cool, and I think that add, you know, pretty cool things to my Jeep. Um, and like I said in that previous video... You know, I you'll see the other mods that I already got on my Jeep. And just comment, like, and I will do other videos on those few mods. Because, on not honesty, uh, this might be my last video. A um, few more after that, probably. Because if you remember from my last one, I was mentioning, mentioning some um, a Jeep trail up in Elko, Wisconsin. And my uncle has a cabin up there. And he kind of told me about that road and area and actually next to it there's an old logging road and another old old beaten road so next weekend i'm taking a nice long vacation weekend for my birthday and i'll probably be going up there along with some other dirt roads around this area where i live so you know you can i'll have a video for that and i got a little something extra for you guys at the end of this video so stick around and i'll meet you guys outside the jeep now all right, guys, outside of my Jeep now, a little, little different uh, backdrop, I guess, instead of watching the deck in my house. So the first mod I'm going to show you is going to be new to everybody since it's just so plainly obvious. And that are these new wheels. And look at that nice offset. That's not too much. It's not too little. I think it's just right. So these are the Altero Trailblade um extreme or um all-terrain tires they got this nice sidewall here to give me some better grip if i'm climbing rocks or something but you know it's gonna give me an overall bigger bigger um footprint off the road and when i air them down the rims are mammoths uh aluminum you know not much to really talk about rims and tires guys but you know they're 17 inch by 9 inch tires or rims the tires are 33 inches by 11 and a half inches so and i'm going to do a bit more detailed review on of my um lift kit so for the newcomers i got a teraflex two and a half inch lift that's how i'm able to fit these 33 inch tires and you know i still have articulation in my tires for off-roading so they're 9550 vss shocks and uh, what VSS really stands for is vehicle specific shocks. So they specifically made these shocks for Wranglers because they all know that uh, you'll be taking this off and on the road. So, you know, they got, they've got on pretty easily. I had to cut a stud off to get the passenger side bolt for the um, shock off to get the wrench off of that actually. And we had to cut in, off this plastic piece that was you know probably it was probably an inch away from the bottom of the battery box which i wasn't too thrilled about but you know um i just don't like cutting things that much on my vehicles except for maybe the muffler and some of the more you know i don't know just the muffler maybe mainly but anyway like i said in the beginning of the video i'm not going to rant too much but i was going to do a walk around of my jeep so I'm sorry I gotta use my front camera because Samsung is weird. But yeah, it's giving my Jeep an overall nice look. I really like the offset of the tires. I like the big, uh, not big lift, but you know, the decent size lift. It's good for a two door, you know, it's noticeably lift, lifted. So anyway, uh, I don't have an inner fender, if you didn't notice that, on my driver's side. But that's changing, okay? 
Okay, I wanna, I wanna, I'm gonna ruin the surprise for you guys. All right, I hate to do this. I like to try to surprise people, but I'm getting uh, deviate off-road inner fenders. They're aluminum. They're going to offer more airflow into the engine blocks, so I don't overheat. I mean, I never really overheat it anyway, but it helps keep the Jeep temperature at a cooler level when I'm off-roading. Because when I first took it off-roading, yeah. I overheated the engine and it melted a little plastic tube thing in my power steering gearbox. $600 fix right there. And I will be getting new sideboards. Yeah, they're going to be tubular. Um, like tubular as in like they're tube shaped, not like tubular dude. <laughs> but, you know, they're going to be steel, textured black, have the off-road coating the same as my front bumper my rear bumper and my roof rack and if you notice i got that fuel door and like the decals and stuff so if you want me to talk about those watch my other video because i talk about them so you know they should be coming next tuesday i ordered them off extreme terrain which is the one decal i have so if you want to know more about them i briefly explain explain them in my other video so i'm really excited to talk about this jeep more and getting some more mods and like i said next weekend um hopefully monday i should have another video the first monday in august that is <laughs> i have a new video of me off-roading so that's going to be fun and if you watch my previous video i'm pretty sure i mentioned it in in that one but anyway i'm doing a jeep community jeep trail ride in the nicolay national forest so that's going to be really cool and really fun to be meeting other Jeepers. So that's all I really have for this video. I'm getting to the seven minute mark, which is perfect, I think. So anyway, guys, I really appreciate the support. I really appreciate the new Instagram followers if you're following me and watching this video. And I will see you guys on and off the road.